I know you moved on to someone new. Whole life is beautiful. You were the light for me to find my truth. I just want to say thank you. Uh, I want to say congratulations, uh, seniors, to uh, making it uh, to the end, but not the end of, of uh, your life. The adventure begins. And uh, for, you, for you guys that uh, we've shared the last two years together in leadership, um, very happy for you, very proud of you. So uh, congratulations, uh, I miss you. I only wish you the best and uh, love you all. This uh, dedication is to you, uh, Mr. K. We've been together for four years. And uh, when I think about you, I, I think of someone who's content. Uh, meaning, you don't need any glory, you don't need any praise. And I love that quality about you. You just do your thing, the job gets done, and uh, and again, I super appreciate that about you. So wish you luck, and uh, if you need anything, you know how to get a hold of me, and uh, and stay who you are. I just wanted to say that I'm very thankful that I got to know Christian. You're such an amazing person. Like you always make me laugh when I'm feeling down. You're very funny. Christian, I just wanted to say that I'm so grateful to have met you in leadership. Leadership has been so fun with you. You always make me and Natalie laugh and we always just have a good time. I hope I get to see you or like still talk to you. But, you know, I just don't want to lose like that part. Thank you so much and I hope that you come visit me and Natalie. And I'm just like, I love you, like, you know. I'm going to miss Maya so much. Um, over the past few years, we've had like a real a real friendship and um, I'm gonna miss her a lot and I'm really really sad that I didn't get to say all of this to her face. Um, I realized that she was one of the most down-to-earth, um, kind, non-judgmental and resourceful people that I'd ever met um, and we would like over the next two years we would come to tell each other and confide in each other in school problems and personal problems and um, all of the above. She's just an awesome person, and uh, I'm going to miss her a lot. So, love you lots, Maya. Hi, Maya. I'm so grateful that we became friends in leadership this year. Your kind heart and hardworking attitude are an inspiration to everyone in the leadership class. I know you will do great things in college and beyond, and I'm so excited to see what you do next. Miss you. The thing that sticks out, uh, the quality I admire about you is uh, you're thoughtful. I think it was for Valentine's, uh, you had picked me and uh, the card that you shared with me. Uh, you put a lot of heart into it and you were, and I really super appreciate that. But at the same time, that's just who you are. When you walk into class, you you always say hi, you ask how I'm doing. If I post something on Instagram, you're one of the ones to respond. And you're just uh, a, a constant person in thoughtfulness. And that's what I love about you and appreciate about you. And I, I wish you well as you begin the next chapter of your life. Hi Jade, I'm sorry that your year here got cut off by the coronavirus, but I hope that the time you spent here was super enjoyable and that you learned a lot. I'm really glad you chose Half and Bay so that we could become friends on leadership, and you always kept me company, which I'm really thankful for. I hope that wherever you go next, you can learn a lot, and I hope that you get to travel the world. The quality that I, I love about you is you're just kind. You're a kind, nice person. And uh, I love the fact that you were a part of our class. I love the fact that you had the courage to come over here and uh, away from France to be a part of our class and our lives. And um, stay kind and I wish you well. I'm so lucky that you came to Huffington Bay and I had a really great time becoming friends with you. I'm really sorry that your senior year was cut short, but we made so many great memories. I'm inspired by your love life attitude and I can't wait to see what amazing things you do next. You know what I like about you, love about you, is you're adventurous. Uh, and you just want to be a part of things. Uh, and you just, uh, you go for it. And you just uh, capture life. Uh, you want to love life. You want to be a part of things. And I love that quality about you. And uh, I, I know that you're going to do some great things uh, in your life. And uh, I wish you well. And uh, you just continue to take the bull by its horns as you live your life.
So I first met you my freshman year in drama and I'm super thankful that I did. Thank you so much for everything that you've done for the high school, especially with the posters that you put around campus boosting school spirit. I know you're gonna have so much fun in college and gonna do amazing things. Hi Gabby, um, I just want to thank you for everything that you've done for me and the leadership class this year. I'm so sad that we didn't get to fully complete this year's leadership, but I'm super, super happy that I got to know you better and I'm so thankful for you and everything you've done from being kind and your sense of humor and everything. So I hope that you have fun in college and Bella and I will definitely visit you. Hey Veronica, um, just as you're graduating, I wanted to let you know how great of a person you are. Um, you're, you're an amazing person, you're so vibrant, you're one of the most vibrant people I know. You're always upbeat and you make every situation so fun. And I think that's really cool. You're a great role model. You're always optimistic. You're always looking to give to other people and you're always you're always yourself. And I think that's really cool and I admire that about you. I'm really gonna miss you at the high school next year. You know what I like about you, love about you? It's you're aggressive. Yeah, you just go after it. You're not afraid and uh, you're not worried about what people think about you. And uh, you just wanna live life and you're gonna be aggressive about it. And I know that that quality is gonna serve you well as you uh, go forward in your life. And uh, I hope uh, that a lot of great things come your way and uh, I'm going to miss you. Veronica, I'm so grateful for all the things that you've taught me and I'm really glad that we became friends. You've been nothing but nice to me from day one and I really appreciate that. You've really left your mark on Half Moon Bay and that inspires me every single day. I can't wait to see what amazing things that you do next. Hey Anna, congratulations on graduating high school. That's such a really great achievement and I'm sorry you didn't get to finish your senior year with all your friends but I hope you had a really great high school experience prior to the quarantine. Um, thank you for being such a really great leader inside and outside of the leadership class, and you were a really great leader for the Outstanding Cooter Luncheon, and you were always so positive and such a nice person. You were just so fun to be around, and you always kept everyone on track, but we still had fun. and that's gonna be something I'm really gonna miss next year. You're a passionate person and I love um, passionate people and it, it inspires me uh, and actually you're very funny too and uh, but what the, but you just know that I think in your heart you know if something needs to be done if it doesn't look like it's gonna get done it's going to get done because you bring a lot of heart and a lot of passion to it and that's what I love about you and I'm going to miss you Good luck. Leadership was so much fun this year. It was great getting to know you. You were always really friendly and it was great working together in a few committees. What's up, Myla? Just wanted to say congrats on graduating. You always seem to be a really nice person and always so fun to be around. And I wish you the best in the future. And we're gonna miss you in leadership next year. Hey, what's up, Myla? I just wanna say thank you for being a really important part of our leadership class this year and always having a positive attitude. Four years now, uh, together, four years. Freshman. Before freshman year, Mrs. Trainer's class, second row, last seat, I remember. The thing I think about you is that you're a devoted person and um, you don't quit. Life has uh, been hard for you in so many ways, but you've remained devoted. You've re uh, remained uh, focused on what you want to do. Uh, you haven't given up and uh, that's, uh, you're so, uh, so much has happened to you. You're so much more mature than so many people your age because of your life experiences and uh, you're and you've remained devoted so don't change that uh, if you need anything you know how to get a hold of me and i will miss you good luck my sister lauren and it's gonna be really sad without her next year but i just want to say that i'm really grateful for all the things that she does for me and she's such a great big sister and like how she pushed me to be in the leadership class and I really enjoy that now. I just really admire how outgoing she is and all the advice that she gives me and I know that you'll do great next year in your first year of college. Go Aztecs. You are definitely the encourager and uh, you're the uh, glue and you want people to feel special 
and I uh, there's there's a lot that I've learned from you uh, in so many ways, and and uh, you're definitely going to be missed. Um, in so many ways, you held the class together. Um, you kept people built up and encouraged, and I uh, will we'll miss the class. We're going to miss that, um, but. Uh, I'm so happy for you that you're moving on. Good luck with your life. Good luck at San Diego State. And uh, if you need anything, you know how to get a hold of me. Stay who you are. I just want to give you a personal send off for the end of this year. Although things didn't really finish the way we could have wanted them to do it, and it really does suck the way things turned out, I'm really grateful to have had you in the class this year. Your optimism and your positive energy were just absolutely unmatched, and quite frankly, it's going to be something that I really miss next year. I hope you're doing well, and I hope you have a lot of fun in college. Take care. Hi, Ashley, also known as Uber, the person who uh, left class early via Uber. Well, almost, I caught you. But anyway, uh, I wish you luck as you go forward. But uh, the quality that I want to celebrate is that you're just a fun person. Uh, I see you, and you don't let you don't get caught up too much with life. You just try to enjoy it. Yeah, you're not too much too worried about what people think about you and uh, you celebrate life and you have fun so don't change stay you hard stay who you are and uh, good luck as you move forward in your life hey I would just like to congratulate Ashley on completing a great senior year um, we didn't interact very much but when we did it was always pretty fun and I would just like to say thank you for being a great senior and congratulations on completing your senior year I know you'll be great at whatever you do, so thank you for everything. Esther, you are my closest friend. You are one of my favorite people in the whole world. You really embody leadership and what leadership is, and leadership will never be the same without you. You really helped me become who I am. You helped me through freshman year, you helped me through this year, and leadership will never be the same. Hi, sir, I just wanna say congratulations for being class of 2020 and graduating through these hard times is going through all this stuff that you have been going through this year. I hope you have a good time at college and I just wanna say thank you for always making me smile, always making me laugh, always being very care caring to everybody, always making sure everyone's opinion is heard. And I just wanna say that I'm going to miss you very much and I hope that you have an amazing following years. Esther, how are ya? Uh, also known as Peppers, you kind of gave yourself your nickname. You know, you came up to me and your eyes were watering. I thought, what's wrong? Because I ate a pepper and it was spicy. Um, and, uh, but you know, nicknames aside, I love the fact um, that you believe. You're a believer. It, uh, it, it, the odds can be stacked up against us but uh, you believe it can be done. And if you have some doubts, just a, when you get that little bit of encouragement, you believe again. And never ever um, change. Uh, that's an important quality we need in people. And so good luck to you, I miss you, love you. Hi Julia, I just wanted to say that I miss you so much and I'm so grateful to have met you in leadership and I just love your energy and your spirit you're always such a fun person to talk to and you're so sweet and loving I'm to so everyone. grateful to have met you in leadership you're such an amazing person you're always so easy and fun to talk to I love how you bring such enthusiasm and spirit to our leadership I'm class. so sad that we only met this year because we didn't have a lot of time to get to know each other but I hope you come visit next year and I know you're gonna do great things in the future and I'm so happy for you slippity you I remember that your nickname was the easiest one to give. You came in here one day to class, go, hey, Mr. Jones, I almost slipped. And I go, I mean, most people wouldn't even share that. And I, that's what I love that uh, about you. You just have a purity of heart. And the, the quality that comes to mind is that I think you just love to learn. Uh, and that's a awesome, awesome quality. And never lose that. Always want to learn. It doesn't matter what it, has to relate to it could be learning how to be relational how to be a friend whatever it is stay a learner you're awesome and i wish you luck hey a dallas but who is a dallas wolfie i still remember how you got that name and um but you know what i 
I love the quality I love about you, one of the qualities, but the, the one that comes to mind is you're confident. Like even if like you just go for it, even if you, yeah, you're just confident and uh, that's contagious. Uh, it brings security because you believe uh, in what you could do and people want to be around people like that. So don't change that and uh, grab life, keep confident and good luck. Congratulations to Dallas. You're one of the kindest people I know. Um, you work very, very hard and you really made an impact on the class. So thank you. Hey Mariella, I'm here to say thank you from all of us in the leadership class for all that you've done. From the outstanding Cougar luncheons to the birthday celebrations, making everything great. We appreciate you and we are hoping you the best in the future. Hey Mariella, on behalf of all Halfman Bay High School students, I want to thank you. The work you've put into the leadership class and improving Halfman Bay High has been amazing and we admire you for it. We can't wait to see the work you do in the future and we wish you a fond farewell. Ah, giggles. Hi, giggles. And I, you know, four years, four, four, four years uh, we've been together in some form, one way or another. And what I, you're just, a, you know what I think about you? You're faithful. Like, if, if something needs to get done, I know that I can count on you being a part of the team. And I love your faithful heart. And I'll miss you, wow, four years together. Well, anyway, good luck, and I'll see you around. Nurse Chloe, uh, miss you. Uh, I love your loyalty. You're kind of my uh, confident. You kind of, you're always there for me. You kind of tell me, maybe we should do this, we shouldn't do that. You're just, you're like a bodyguard. You know what, if I could change nicknames, I would call you the bodyguard. Because I think you, re you really protected me. Um, and I uh, wanted to, to make sure that, uh, the, in a lot of ways, the best for me, but ultimately the best for the class. And uh, so, you're, and I love that. And so, I, you're a loyal, so to me, it's loyalty. And, uh, and that's a strong quality, very strong. Anyway, I wish you well and good luck to you. I've known Chloe since we were little kids. I always looked up to her as the big sister I never had. She's funny kind, caring, and hardworking. I know she's gonna do great things in life and I'm extremely proud of her. For always just being like a lending hand and always like going out of your way to try to help me with like pitching when I did that and like all that fun stuff and just for always being like a super good like role model and like showing me the way I guess. And I know with everything that's going on, it's kind of like a bummer, but I know that you'll make it out super great. And I hope wherever you go in the future, I know you're gonna do so well and I can't wait to see where you go next. Hey Brian, or Widom, what do you mean? I, <laughs> I, I, you always ask me that question, what do you mean? What do you mean? Well, anyway, uh, Brian, I, I think you're amazing. And I think the quality that I admire about you is uh, you're, you're relational. You could talk to a tree and the tree would probably start having a conversation with you. Yeah, you just seem to relate to everyone. And I think that quality that you have is going to serve you well as you live your life. And uh, uh, never, ever uh, change that about you. Um, good luck, and I wish you well. Hopefully, I will we'll see you around. Congratulations, Brian. You're one of the kindest, hardest working people I know. Um, you light up the room and you walk into it. Um, you're just a really nice guy, and I know you're gonna do great things, so congrats. Hey Brian, uh, congrats on graduating. I hope you had a great three and a half years. Um, I just wanna say thank you so much for uh, being so welcoming this year in leadership, um, especially in the very beginning of the year. Um, you really welcomed me to the group. Um, so I hope you have a great uh, experience after high school, and yeah, good luck to you, Brian. Congratulations, seniors of 2020. Thank you guys for inspiring us, for being such great role models. For all of your hard work and dedication you've put in for this year. For always being there for us. For leading us. For working so hard. And for setting the standard of what a great leadership student should be. And I know it sucks that this is how it all ends, but it's been a really fun night with you guys. You're all amazing people. And I know you're going to do great things. 
and we wish you luck on this next part of your life. We'll miss you guys. So, uh, congratulations. Uh, I miss you. I only wish you the best and uh, love you all.